So I was talking to a coworker about uh, the new Little Mermaid, and uh, you know we got to talking about how some people are saying that I, uh, I think the actress's name is Hallie Bailey. I apologize if I've gotten that wrong. Um, I haven't really kept up with like live action Disney stuff ever since Mulan was a total disappointment. Um, anyways, uh, so we, we got to talking about how some people were saying that Miss Bailey doesn't have the right look to play Ariel. And, you know, we did agree with that to some extent. Like, unless the mermaids are living very close to the surface of the water, there's no real reason for them to, like, have large amounts of melanin, like, from the sun. So let's assume that these mermaids don't live close to the surface of the water, that they live, like, further down where there is little to no sunlight. Uh, in that case, they would have pitch black skin to match, you know, the pitch black water because no sunlight. Um, and oh, it would, it would also be really, really cold because there's no sunlight. So they would need a really thick layer of blubber uh, to keep themselves warm. Um, they wouldn't need eyes because, you know, when there's very little or no sunlight, you don't really need to see visually because there's no light anyways. So the way that they would locate things is through something called echolocation. And in order to do that, they would have like just giant foreheads, like, like if you've ever seen a, uh, a beluga whale, something like that, you know, just an absolute huge melon. Um, so, you know, basically a anatomically correct mermaid would be, uh, eyeless, would have a giant melon, um, would be fat, would have incredibly dark skin. Um, and none of this is meant to disparage Ms. Bailey, by the way. Like, we're just saying that, you know, she has very like Hollywood looks, you know, she's got a very, you know, well-proportioned face, you know, her forehead is a normal size, she has, she has eyes, um, she's got like not pitch black skin, you know, she looks like a very pretty human person, and a mermaid would not look like that, so I guess like, I mean, I guess if you really wanted, like, a human to play a mermaid, like, you wanted humanoid mermaids, then I think they would look more like if, uh, if, uh, I mean, this, I'm just saying this name because she's also been in the news recently, but, like, if Lizzo wore makeup over her eyes to make it look like she didn't have eyes and she had, like, an absolute giant prosthetic uh, forehead the size of like the rest of her head. Yeah, yeah, that would be a pretty accurate mermaid. I don't think anyone would have an issue with that at all. Bye.